Hi, welcome to Iggy Goalies Goes Box Break number 45. Today we're doing three boxes of 10-11 Panini Zenith Hockey. Our current time is 6.26 p.m. Saturday, September the 8th. I do know that I left New Jersey about half an hour later than I was supposed to. That was my fault, but I'm glad I got that team in there. Uh, the rookie, I mean, the rookie rivalry will be going to the owner with the most teams, which I will show you in a moment. And I don't believe it's subject to change once New Jersey finishes. So, I'm going to show you the New Jersey auction, which will be the last auction by the end of this uh, video. So don't worry, last auction will be presented. But as for now, the current last auction, won by Marathon 20, the Atlanta Thrashers at a final value of 382 US. And our current list of winners and New Jersey's will be added at the end of the video. There we go. Western Conference on the left, Eastern Conference on the right. We can see that the owner with the most teams who gets that rookie rivalry is Hockey Montreal 38. Alrighty. Now that we got that stuff out of the way, we'll get to the serial numbers. And once again, so rookie rivalry. Dual jerseys, Zach Kassian, Aaron Palushaj, for Hockey Montreal 38. So first one, NE9408562. Nine three seven one one seven eight two and nine three seven one one seven eight three for those uh, old school old school card lovers you'll notice way back there is a tin of sweet shot look for that Sunday later this evening on the right we're gonna have the titanium one box where I got four uh, that is four. Uh, box number four out of the four that's left out of a 16 box master case so I'll have another three boxes of that coming up checklist our jumbos which will be dealt with at the end empty box almost now it's an empty box okay so well, let's get going on this good luck to everybody and uh, National Treasures and Dunross Elite rookie cards come out of the jumbo, so gotta wait until the end for that. So we're starting off with what seems like a pack of base. Hopefully my timing is accurate so I can get that New Jersey auction in the end. Ooh, nice base of Mario Lumia. Let me just see if I can adjust this camera a bit better. There we go, space here. Our second pack of base there. And we have a yours truly autograph. Uh, Brian Boucher. The Philadelphia Flyers. I do believe he has an NHL record of most consecutive shutouts. And he was only a backup netminder at that point. I think he was... Uh, can't remember what team it was for. Cannot remember. But that's a nice card. And next up, we have Mike Knubel, Eric Fair, uh, Alex Ovechkin, Mosaics for the Washington Capitals. Like I was saying, Brian Boucher, he did set up that record, just not, I just can't remember what team it was for. I have a feeling Phoenix with Wayne Gretzky behind the bench, I, I don't, I just can't remember that well on that one. And next up, we have a Red Hot Rick Nash. Red Hot Parallel Rick Nash. For the Columbus Blue Jackets. Next up, rookie for the New York Rangers. This will be a rookie roll call. Derek Stepan. Derek Stepan. There you go. Spacer. Some base. I'm gonna start off with base. Third pack of base cards. Sometimes the beginning of these boxes isn't that much fun. But those three uh, hits, those four hits we have so far, not bad. Not a bad start. The yours truly autograph, nice. And we have our first rookie, Travis Morin, for the Dallas Stars. Travis Morin. 
335 out of 999. 335 out of 999. Except the autofocus does not want to show you that, so I'll have to go with my word on that. 335 out of 999. Next up, rookie roll call for the St. Louis Blues. Kevin Shattenkirk. Kevin Shattenkirk. Hopefully you guys can see that. Rookie roll call. Jersey. Not bad, not bad. Card is not numbered. Two base to finish off. Next up. Crease is the word for the Montreal Canadiens. Carey Price. Card is not numbered. Spacer. Two base. Base up next, and we have an Epics rookie jersey. Nice for the Edmonton Oilers, newly signed Jordan Aberle. Nice, nice hit there. Jordan Aberle for the Edmonton Oilers rookie Epics jersey. 41 out of 100. Well, his number is 14, so you could, maybe one day he'll uh, switch that around, but as for now, it's his rookie, or his jersey number, but backwards. Maybe you can get something out of that on eBay. And next up, Cal Clutterbuck for the Minnesota Wild, Gifted Grinders. Cal Clutterbuck. That was a nice hit for Edmonton. and I'm happy that it went like that today. That would be the third or fourth Edmonton rookie by Eberle or Taylor Hall in this master case of Zenith. Like honestly, the, not a lot of people know a lot about Zenith, but some really nice stuff can come out of here. I've, I've only heard positive things about Zenith since I've been doing this, but uh, I would like to say, besides the one box I will do next weekend, not picking this up again. Not because I don't like it, but and not a money thing, it's just doesn't seem like there's enough interest for it. But if anybody wants me to do an individual box here and there, just let me know. And I can work something out. That first pack was base. Our second pack of the second box is base. Third pack. For Calgary Flames, rookie on card autograph, TJ Brody. TJ Brody. That is 936 of 999. Cool. It's one of the better rookie cards. Not the player, it's just I haven't noticed a lot of these on card ones have a number or serial on the back. So that's somewhat of a first for me. And for the Edmonton Oilers, we have. Payarvi, Eberle, Taylor Hall, Mosaics for the Edmonton Oilers. There we go. Space here. Space, space. So, Edmonton hits keep coming and coming at us. Gotta love it when you actually get Edmonton hits. As a breaker, I am rooting for Edmonton at all times. <laughs> Edmonton and Pittsburgh, pretty much. Red Hot for the Toronto Maple Leafs, Mikhail Grabowski. Mikhail Grabowski. New $5 million contract as of last season. Not sure if he deserves it. I like him. He plays hard, but not sure if he commands $5 million anywhere else in the NHL, except for Toronto, of course. And we have Chasing the Cup, Brad Richards for the Dallas Stars. Brad Richards. Chasing the Cup. With no autofocus, of course. Nice looking card though. It looks a little bit like uh, some titanium stuff. Space here. And two base. Next up, we have a pack of base. Ooh, we 
have a Winter Warriors here. It'll be our first one of today's break. We also have a rookie in the same pack. Back up that minder for the Dallas Stars, Richard Bachman. Rookie, Richard Bachman. 975 out of 999. Came up with some uh, brilliant, brilliant games for Dallas this, uh, this past season. And wow. Well, this is the nicest Winter Warriors I've pulled out of this Master Case. We have a prime three color patch. You got the yellow. I know you can't see it because of the autofocus right now. Oh, there we go. And we have a little bit of a seam there between the yellow and the black. Some black jersey and some white jersey. So that's a prime Winter Warriors of David Krejci. Center for the Boston Bruins. That is number 37 out of 50. 37 out of 50. Probably the nicest Winter Warriors card I have pulled out of this Master Case. Next up, we have some beasts. And, creases the word for the Atlanta Thrashers, a.k.a. Winnipeg Jets, Andre Pavlich. Andre Pavlich. Spacer. Base and base. Next up, start off base and Winter Warriors Jared Bull for the Columbus Blue Jackets Jared Bull wow autofocus you are hating me today there we go Jared Bull two base last pack of the second box one more box to go three jumbo cards too nicely cut open no tearing today no tearing Mark Stahl, Gifted Grinders for the New York Rangers. Mark Stahl, younger brother of Jordan and Eric Stahl, now playing together for the Carolina Hurricanes. Can they bring a Stanley Cup back there? Cam Ward and Net? I don't know. Guess we'll find out if hockey starts. Gary Batman. Get on that, Gary Batman. I mean, the players already said that, yes, eventually we are okay with m making the escrow payments you want, but Gary Bettman and the owners would like 19.5% right off the bat, which is kind of extreme and kind of not a good way to get those formal talks going towards getting the season back, as training, training camp is supposed to start on September 15th, only days away. We don't have a CBA. How crappy is that? Oh, nice. For the Boston Bruins, we have Matt Barkowski, on-card rookie autograph, 246 out of 9.99. And for the Pittsburgh Penguins, we have Eric Tangrady, Jordan Stahl, Evgeny Malkin, Mosaics, no jersey in this one. Spacer, two base. Next up, we have base, base, and gifted grinders for the New York Rangers, Ryan Callahan. I believe he is the captain of the Rangers now, Ryan Callahan. There we go. Spacer. Some base. I think we're going to be a little bit early on that uh, New Jersey slot, but I'll try and keep timing this out properly. I have to get to about 22 minutes on the video. I know I'm only at 14 right now. So we have some more base. Keeping us entertained with those base packs. Oh, yeah. Next up, we have... Crease is the word for the Anaheim, Mighty, uh, Anaheim Ducks. I keep saying Mighty Ducks. Jonas Hiller. Jonas Hiller. Probably the sickest helmet in the NHL, just jet black like that. I love that. If I was a goalie, that'd be my helmet for sure. Base. And next is base. Next up. For the Nashville Predators, Mark Dekanich, rookie. Mark Dekanich, now we're playing with the Columbus Blue Jackets. 436 out of 999. He might be pushing for his starting job if Steve Mason can't get his act together. 
wall his consistency together. And for the LA Kings, we have Braden Shen, Drew Doughty, Andre Kopitar. Braden Shen, this would be a rookie of him. Jersey is for Braden Shen, and this is a Mosaics. Single jersey, the LA Kings, rookie jersey, Braden Shen. Next up, base. Red Hot for the Vancouver Canucks, Daniel Sedin. Red Hot, Vancouver Canucks, Daniel Sedin. For the Chicago Blackhawks, Chasing the Cup, Corey Crawford. Oh, Mike Richards does not a focus, but this one does. He just likes the Blackhawks more. Spacer. Space, space. Next up, we have Base. And rookie roll call for the Anaheim Mighty Ducks jersey, Cam Fowler. Not too shabby. Card is not numbered. So decent amount of hits in this uh, break of Zenith. Can't wait to find out what's in those jumbo cards. Hopefully Tyler Sagan or Jeff Skinner National Treasures would be nice. Space here. And so we finish off the boxes with some base. Alright, let me just check up on the New Jersey slot right now. We're at 5 minutes and 58 seconds. I don't think I can do the jumbos that slowly. I don't think I can, but we'll see what happens. First up, Henrik Sedin. Just a little reminder, titanium later on tonight, sweet shot and certified tomorrow, Tony Esposito. So remember the jumbos go out to the player on the jumbo and the cards on the inside go to the team on the inside. So this way, there's basically double the hits out of the jumbos. Hope everybody is cool with that. And we have Brendan Shanahan, and he. Alright, so I do have to tap these down in case anybody is angry with the way I'm about to handle these cards. I will find out where the card is. Maybe I can avoid it. Yep, looks like I can avoid it on the Brendan Shanahan. Yep, we're going to be good on this. Okay, so start biting your fingers, everybody. Hopefully some National Treasures rookie autographs come out of here. Like I said, P.K. Subban was pulled. Taylor Hall was pulled. Not in my videos, but it was pulled. I do know that. Alright, so... Epics for the Chicago Blackhawks, Duncan Keith. Duncan Keith, Epics, number two, defense. Cool. No complaints on that one. So we see, barely any damage done. Much better than tearing it open and shredding the crap out of these things. As I have pulled the Crosby, the Ovechkin, the Carey Price. Okay, so I do have to tap this one down. There we go. We have something here. Rookie. Okay. So hardly any damage. And rookie for the Calgary Flames. 116 out of 199. 
we have Henrik Carlsen. Let me just show you the number now. 116 out of 199. There we go. Calgary eventually got a hit. And last up, Henrik Sedin. Okay, it's a little high up there, so. There we go. Does not want to open sesame yet. We're almost there, guys. I know this part is a little bit quiet as I concentrate. I'm trying to preserve these jumbos as much as possible. Not happening very well today. Alright, there we go. We have cut Sadine's little baby face in half. Oh, nice. We have a rookie here. Out of 78 out of 99. As soon as I came out of there with a little bit of a nick, but definitely not from where I was cutting. It's not a, it's not an exact knife mark, but should be all right. So we have Paul Byron. Nice way to finish off. Sticker autograph rookie for the Buffalo Sabers. Seventy-eight out of ninety-nine. All right, everybody. So that does it for Zenith. One more time. Jumbo. So the jumbos go up to teams on the front. And let's see where we are with the New Jersey Devils. We have 51 seconds left. Uh, let me just show you the sweet shot. That's, that will be coming up. And uh, to keep you entertained while we wait for this, let me just show you some pictures of what can come out of sweet shot. I know it's only five cards in the tin, but uh, so there you go. Uh, Phil Kessel for the Bruins. Dennis Potvin for the New York Islanders. Uh, for Montreal, things like Guy Lafleur can come out. Keep in mind, this is Carey Price's rookie year. Also, Vincent LeCavalier ice signings. Uh, Jonathan Tay's rookie year for the Blackhawks puck signings. Those go for about thirty-five bucks on eBay, so it's not a bad find. Also, things like Patrick Kane puck signings. And we're gonna go back to New Jersey here. Zero seconds left. Let's see who got this one. So the last auction is. One by Nisnor, Nisnor, 001. For a final value of 651, the New Jersey Devils, and I'll add them in right now. All right, everybody. So we've done it backwards, but we did it. So thank you for watching, and uh, see you throughout the weekend and throughout the month for more of my box breaks. Thanks again, guys. Bye bye.